to Crazy Van Gogh I'm here because I'm having an amazing day. So it is a little bit of a different setup today um, because it is currently like 1, yeah, 1.30 in the morning and <laughs> the Cruella de Vil official trailer is out and I actually am very excited for this video but, you know, I had to move location because my parents are currently sleeping and I'm trying to keep my voice down even though this is the worst place to do it. It's the most echoey part of the house <laughs> because of the dials but oh well, I gotta do it. Um, but yeah, the Cruella de Vil trailer is here. Now, um, I loved the Dalmatians when I was younger and I loved the Cruella de Vil song and I wish that they made it longer because it's just such a short tune but it's so catchy and I love it and as you can see I sort of got into a spirit of it <laughs> getting ready to be sort of like in the mood for her. I did my makeup so like the black and red, the white didn't really mix with the makeup so I didn't do that but um, I'm so excited and I cannot wait to see what we have in store because obviously Emma Stone is Cruella. Um, we're gonna find out the obviously the backstory of Cruella and I'm so excited so let's jump straight into it. But before that, please remember to like, subscribe and comment if you enjoyed this video, but also to keep up to date with all my other reactions to more video games, movies and trailers. So without further ado, let's jump straight into this. From the very beginning, I realised I saw the world differently than everyone else. That didn't sit well with some people. But I wasn't for everyone. I guess they were always scared. Ooh. Psycho. <laughs> but a new day brings new opportunities. Ooh. And I was ready to make a statement. Oh, and the person. How does the saying go? <gasps> oh! I am woman. Hear me roar. This looks good! Oh, I'm just getting started, though. Ooh! The thing is, I was born crazy. Born bad. And a little bit mad. Ooh, I got chills. the fifth nice <gasps> dude like what that was amazing I actually really enjoyed that trailer that was so good now I will say I actually am very excited for this movie because it is an original sort of like backstory to Cruella because obviously like we know that like she was obsessed with the Dalmatians and like she had a look for fashion and even the T I th I'm pretty sure there was a TV show as well with the Dalmatians and she was like into fashion and just all these different like spotted clothing and spotted like paintings etc so she had an eye for art and as you can see it it's evident because it like she's obviously into fashion and oh I love that part where she like, like flicks like this the, I'm not sure if it was a cigarette, but like if it was like the the match and just it burns the dress away. Ah, oh, that's good. And it sort of gave me like Alice in Wonderland vibes, like the White Queen and the Red Queen. Like oh, so cool and just beautiful. Like it's so unique. And this is like me and my friends were just talking about this too. Like. Like when the remake trailers come around, we're like, eh, we're not too excited because you know, it's a remake. It's not something original, but with this, and I, I did see a lot of hype of people saying like, you know, like, oh my God, this actually looks really good. And it does look really good because it's new, it's fresh. We haven't had something like this, especially from Disney in a long, long time where it's original content, like in terms of like the like authentic Disney stories um, that we've grown up with, like this is new. So I'm excited to see like where this goes and like her story and just like, it's sort of like that, like a spy film almost, like the poison tip that she had in her hand when walking through like the masquerade party and just all the balls and stuff. It seems very like spy-like, like agent, like 007 sort of thing. Like that's why I'm so excited for it. And that's like sort of my sort of vibe, like fashion, just like, it's sort of like um, Ocean, Ocean 8, I think it was, that recently came out or 
was it Ocean Eleven? I can't remember. But the one with like Sandra Bullock and then like I think it was Rihanna and all those different beautiful actresses. That was such a good film. I loved that film. So this feels sort of like that but very like, I don't know, it's very like retro, like vintage. Vintage is the word that I'm looking for. Vintage style movie that's, you know, it's gonna be fun for the comedy and just, you know, it's good. Thank you guys so much for watching this. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give a like, subscribe, comment, and tell me your thoughts on the trailer for Cruella DeVille or Cruella. So I'm so excited for this. It looks so good. And Emma Stone is such an incredible actress and that's why even with this it doesn't seem like she's crazy it just seems like she's very eccentric and nobody understands her like vision so that's why I like it like when they're not trying to like show them off as super psycho or crazy like with the big eyes and just all this stuff but instead like little little things like you could see like you know like she gets very agitated or like even how she was in the bed like she was like crying and frowning and then just smiling like love that that's great I just I don't like it when it's over the top and stuff and I think we all know a good example <coughs> Game of Thrones but I absolutely loved this trailer and I cannot wait to get like a pro well this was a minute 32 I thought it would be longer but it's nice to see that we only got a short trailer compared to a lot of other trailers that are quite long so I am excited to get more news on this um, and I would definitely be going to see this in cinemas if the cinemas continue to stay open here in Australia <laughs> so again thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video crazy Vangle out Woo!